Hi, I'm Terry Johnson, one of the co-authors of the Fuddlebrook series. And with me, I have Chloe. How are you today, Chloe? I am really good. Good. Did you have good holidays? Mm -hmm. But the holidays are over. And what does that mean, Chloe, in our part of the country? It's really cold. What can we do? We can put on our gloves, hats, coats. But what about the poor animals? No. Well, in our activity today, from a change of season, we're going to demonstrate what animals do to stay warm in the winter. Well, on your hand, Chloe, I'm going to put our version of fat, which is Vaseline, and we're going to create an insulator on one of your hands. So this may be gooey, but I promise you, Vaseline is pretty good for your skin, so it's not going to hurt you. Okay. So we're going to just rub this all over your hand. Now I'm going to take the Ziploc bags and put on Chloe's hands to create an insulator glove. What I would like for you to do is to put both hands in the bowl of water with ice and dip it all the way down in there. One hand is warmer than the Seven, other. Eight, is it? Mm -hmm. You can tell a big difference yep. already? That's yes. great. Well, go ahead and put it up. All right. Well, tell yep. us what you felt, Chloe, while I take these rubber bands off of you. Well, one hand was like really cold, and which was this one, and then this one wasn't. And, it was like covered in fat. So very much like a fat would be in the animals. When they build up their fat in the fall, then it allows them to stay warm in the winter. Now let's go take our winter nap. I think that's a good idea, Chloe. Bye-bye. Check out all our books and experiments at fuddlebrook.com.